a first edition of Lycidas by John Milton. I'm Adam Douglas from Peter Harrington and I'd like to show you this very rare early John Milton poem. Uh, the poem itself is contained in a book, a memorial volume. And if I turn to the title page there, we see that it's in memory of Edward King, who had drowned. And as we go down, we see it's printed. The memorial volume is uh, his fellow students were invited or moved to write elegies for his death. And it's printed there in Cambridge in 1638. He was a student at Cambridge, and Milton was one of his fellow students. The book is in two halves. The first half, um, which would be more traditional at this date, are verses in Latin in memoriam to their lost friend. But then the second half of the book has a uh, separate title page where we see obsequies to the memory of Mr. Edward King, Anno Domini, 1638. And there again, the same printer's name, obviously, in English this time. And the second part of the book has the English poems, of which by far the most famous is Lycidas, or I suppose it should be Lucidas, as it's a Greek name. But um, when I was taught this poem at university, uh, everybody said Lycidas, and they still do in the book trade. So we'll just have to stick to that uh, anglicized pr pronunciation. Uh, it's a long poem where Milton really announces his arrival, his uh, voice, quite new in English poetry at this time. Um, very powerful memorial poem to his lost friend. Um, it's, I think, the longest poem in the English section of the memorial volume, and it, it's placed last. We see here right at the end his initials, just J.M., John Milton, and then the finis for the whole book underneath it. So this is only the second poem published by John Milton. He published uh, in the second folio in 1632 um, a short poem um, to Shakespeare, uh, which is um, added to the verses at the beginning of that volume. So that's his first appearance in print, but this is his second and uh, really a very um, powerful piece of uh, lyric verse writing um, by the young Milton. This copy is in a later binding. It's uh, bound in the 17th century manner, but this is a, a much later binding. Um, but it's uh, quite pleasing condition. It's been in a number of famous collections. You can see a great many book plates here. Um, Frank Brewer, Bemis has the smart one. There's also uh, um, Houghton and uh, The Garden. It's really a... Uh, <laughs> It's been in a lot of libraries. And the reason that it's been in so many is because the book is so rare. It's not something that would uh, have survived in large numbers, uh, really quite um, sort of localized interest. Cambridge student dies is not of earth shattering importance. And so um, this, um, this, this book would have been rare uh, probably shortly after publication, but it's always been sought after as a, a great work of 17th century poetry. For more details of this book and for others, please look at our website.